Hey, everybody. It's Faith from Firesign Tarot. I hope everybody's well. Virgo. The universe has decided that you will receive your September round two reading today. Okay. Don't know why this gets so dirty. It bothers me. Okay. This reading will be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for September round two. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, Virgo, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay, too. You can check your Moon, Rising, or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind... Time and energy are both fluid and all things can be, but vice versa. It might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And our difference, cross watchers are always welcome at the fire sign tarot table. Everybody's always welcome at my table, and I appreciate y'all stopping by. Thanks for coming down today to hang out with little old me. While you're here, if you're new, and you think we might get along, think we vibing all right, you can hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. That'd be super cool. And, you know, the like button while you're at it. And for all my returning visitors, thank you so much for coming back. I appreciate you guys, too. Love and light and blessings to all. Okay, Virgo. Two things we gotta go over before I invoke the cards and throw them down for you. One, never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. By life-altering, I mean if it is going to completely destroy everything that you have worked for, if you make the wrong decision... You might not want to trust a deck of cards with that decision be the mine or anyone else's. It is just smart practice. It's not that I don't believe in the tarot. I read tarot. I believe in the tarot very much. However, you have free will and you need to exercise it to the best of your intelligent ability. Okay? The cards. It doesn't always have to play out the way the cards say it's going to play out. Exercise your own free will. Okay? Make wise, smart choices. Two. Speaking of the cards, if it's not your reading, not your story, not your message, if it's not vibing with you in any way, shape, or form, and it's not making sense in your life, leave them on the table and walk away. It's not your message. It's general. It's not going to be your message every time. Okay? All right. One more. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Virgos, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for September Round 2. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with me this morning. I appreciate you, and I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given, and I ask that you help me use it to accurately and precisely bring Virgo to their highest possible spiritual good and put them in their highest possible spiritual path. Virgo, why are you here? Three of Swords! Why? That had to suck. You're hurting. Okay, well. How did grandma used to put it? Pain helps you grow. It does. It's shitty, but it helps you grow. It's gonna be all right. We'll work it out. What happened? What happened? High priestess reversed. Okay. Oh, gosh. The High Priestess, she can speak of secrets, she speaks of intuition, things being unseen. In the reverse, she can speak of ego, or not listening to your intuition. We'll get clarity here in a minute. It, it's the past, okay? I ask what happened, the cards give me an answer. What's going on right now? King of Pentacles. This is not bad. It's not bad at all. You got it going on. You got some bread stacked. You're doing well. You probably have a good job. Be you male or female. Doesn't matter. Insert whatever pronoun works for you. What is the ultimate catch? That is stability. That is being grounded. Also a card of Virgo. Just throwing that out there. Ah! Okay. So. What's the immediate future look like? There's a very large truck in my driveway. Give me a second. 
pardon the interruption, loves. It was FedEx dropping off some stuff for me. Anyway, so in the immediate future, we have the Queen, uh, 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 Prince of Cups. Could be an offer of love. Somebody coming in with a cup. Okay. Hmm. Wow. I just noticed the expression on his face. It's like he's looking down at this cup, wondering if it's going to be good enough. Like, wondering if there's enough in it. He, she, insert whatever pronoun. I mean, you know the drill. Can I get an outcome? Three of Pentacles reversed. Mmm. Second three. Y'all know how I feel about threes. That's just because my brain automatically goes there. I don't know why. Could be third party, could not. I don't know. They're pretty far away from each other. So we'll see what the rest of the cards have to say. All right. I don't believe this. I've been using this deck a lot. And I may have to go out and buy a new clarifier deck at some point because if every sign's going to end up with air, I mean, <laughs> it is what it is, guys. Okay. I also have Taurus on the board. Just throwing that out there. A little earth. A lot of earth. Could be an earth sign. Might be a Taurus. Who knows? Prince of Cups is water. Could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Very strong Taurus energy. King of Pentacles is very strongly associated with Taurus. Three of Pentacles is a Capricorn card. I mean, you know, take it however. If a sign fits, cool. If not, you know, it's whatever. The energy's coming off the card more than anything. Okay. Universe Source Spirit Guides. Can I get... I'm trying not to sneeze. Can I get the energy of the person or situation that Virgo is dealing with? September round two. One more. One more. Do, 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 do. Four of Swords reversed. My, my, my. Hmm. Now I'm wondering, Three of Swords, overall energy of the reading, is this your pain or somebody else's? That's, that's restless energy that's unable to get through a heartbreak. Huh. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Let's just see what the rest of the cards have to say here and now. Nine of Pentacles reversed. Oh, no. Oh, no. Could be financial codependency. Could be emotional codependency. It's not wanting to be alone. Immediate future... King of Pentacles reversed. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. 
outcome. Queen of Wands reversed. Everything is upside down. Jeez. Jeez. Set those over there for now. Hmm. Okay, universe. Source, spirit guides. I'm not going to say anything to like it clarity. The gears are going if you can't smell the smoke, but I'm not saying anything. Nope. <sighs> clarity for Virgo and the person or situation they're dealing with. September round two. I'm not a finger pointer. I'm not a sugar coater. Why is the high priest just reversed here? Queen of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, High Priestess. Oh, honey, you brought the pain, didn't you? Oh, honey. What did you do? I do not have a big enough table. One more. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Wasn't time yet. I don't know if this was ego based or if it just wasn't time yet. But I feel like you came forward with truth may not have been in the nicest manner. The words may not have come out correctly, but you inflicted a little bit of pain on somebody. It wasn't the right time. You just wanted to be single. You wanted to be independent. Why is the... Uh, four of swords... Five, four of swords reverse tear for the other person. Why is the four of swords reverse tear for the other person? Oh my. Six of cups reversed. Yeah! Nah, ha, 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 ha. You left somebody with salty taste in their mouth. I don't think you meant to. Empress. Oh, snap. One more. Two swords reversed. Just caught this. Not sure. If, hmm, I don't know who this is going to apply to. Could be a baby mama or baby daddy.
might be. It doesn't necessarily have to be. Somebody could be pregnant. I don't know. The Empress does represent represent ugh, represent pregnancy. I'll throw a clarifier on it in a second. It's like somebody just took a difficult choice out of my hands. Two of Swords reversed. Why the Empress? Three of Pentacles. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's another three. Three pentacles upright. Okay. Um, shoot. Flipped into the upright mid, mid exit too. So wow. I feel like somebody begrudgedly. Maybe threw a band-aid on it. Maybe went back to an ex. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever the situation is, I don't think they're happy. Nine of Pentacles reversed. All right. Um, why is the King of Pentacles here? Why is the King of Pentacles here? Hermit reversed. Hermit reversed. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Wow. Mm. You are concentrating on you, stacking your bread, doing your thing. You are not looking for love. You are not looking for commitment. You're, you're, you're not throwing energy into anything. One of this Eight of Pentacles reversed. Magician. Manifesting new things, new paths, new beginnings. Okay, some of you may have just quit a job in the process of leaving a job. total hermit. You're not even going out. I don't even think some of you are leaving the house much. You gotta be, Virgo, you gotta be careful with that magician card. P.S. Um, Mercury retrograde pre-shadow. Okay. The universe is always listening. Just throwing this out there. You need to be careful what comes out of your mouth right now. And you need to be careful of the thoughts that pop into your head because the universe is always listening. And sometimes I'm not going to say that the universe gets it twisted. The universe never gets it twisted, but you get exactly what you ask for. Okay. Just throwing that out there. So if something happens to come out of your mouth wrong or pop into your head wrong, the universe is going to give you exactly what you, exactly what you manifest right now. Why is the Nine of Pentacles reversed here for the other person, for the here and now? I feel like, I feel like the other person may have thrust themselves into a codependent situation. Or they're currently in a codependent situation. Four of Pentacles reversed. Strength reversed. Seven of Cups.
Why the Four of Pentacles reversed? They're in a codependent situation. They're drained. They're, they're searching for other options. There's negative energy. They want to let go, but maybe they're not balanced enough to be able to let go. There's negative energy. Wow. Okay. What? What? Okay. Immediate future. Tell me about this Knight of Cups, Virgo. Prince of Cups. Tell me about this Prince of Cups. Prince, Knight, same thing. Six of Swords. Huh? Well. Well. That, that's a return. That's a return. Five of Swords. Standing up, doing what's right, and no matter what other people think or feel about it, doing what's best for you. One more. Judgment reversed. Oh shit. One on judgment reversed. Eight of Wands reversed. Questioning what's in the cup. Questioning if what is in the cup is good enough. You manifesting a cup right now? You manifesting a return? Are you questioning a decision? I just want to be single. Work on me. I don't feel like this is going anywhere. Are you questioning the words that come out of your mouth? Are you a little heartbroken? I don't see a communi a return and a communication trying to stand up, do what's right. Going much of anywhere. Not with this justice reversed. Or this eight of wands reversed or this three of pentacles reversed. I hate to say this. I'm not going to sugarcoat this. I think it might be a little bit too little too late. But let's we'll see what the rest of the cards have to say. Why is this King of Pentacles reversed here? Tried to flip, didn't. I'm not going to force the message. One more. Come on. Why is the King of Pentacles reversed here? Sun reversed. Oh, shoot. Four of Wands reversed. No happiness, no celebration, no coming together. Hanged man. I'm hearing, well, I wasn't good enough for you before. It wasn't going to fruit, remember? I wasn't your sunshine. High priestess reversed. Egos! Wow. Oh, snap. They get a hand it right back to you, Virgo. You've got to be careful. You've got to be careful with that sword. You've got to be careful. Oof. 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 Oh, okay. Why the three of pentacles reversed here for Virgo? For an outcome. Why the three of pentacles reversed? Why 
Knight of Wands reversed. No forward movement. No foundations being built. No coming together. Ace of Swords reversed. No communication. No new start. Seven of Wands reversed. Death reversed. Defeat. Why death reversed? Death reversed. Knight of Swords reversed. Blockage. Blockage. It's going to be left hanging out there. It's just going to be left hanging out there. Two upside down knights. It's not moving forward. There's no communication. An outcome of no communication. Ace of Swords, no communication. Defeat. Defeat. One more on this death reversed. Ace of Cups reversed. I'm not going to beat a dead horse. It's not going to be allowed to metamorphosize into anything else. It's just, it's just dead. It's just dead. It's just dead. Wow. Wow. Why is the Queen of Wands here for the other person? Why the Queen of Wands reversed? I think you're just going to let it lay there. Queen of Pentacles. Sorry, not Queen of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles. You reap what you sow. Knight of Cups reversed. Ace of Wands. Okay. Ten of Wands. Wow. They are releasing the burden of this connection, starting something new. Possibly with this X that they ended up with back here. I don't know. <laughs> Could be releasing, I don't know, they're, they're releasing something and starting something new. Ultimately, I think they're going to be left wishing that it taken your cup. But it was a reap what you sow situation. Wow. Damn. That was messed up. Just saying, that was messed up. Heartbreak screws with people, guys. Heartbreak severely screws with people. The devil, the hanged man reversed, the ten of pentacles. Release yourself from toxic connections. Do not stay hung up on them. Because you don't grow if you do. Heartbreak is growth. If you do not release yourself from something and allow heartbreak to occur, you don't grow. Nine of Swords, Six of Cups. Do not allow feelings, be them good or bad, of the past. Don't, don't, just basically just don't let it keep you up in there to keep you from making logical decisions. 
two swords reversed. Don't let the past dictate your decisions for the future. Don't stay hung up. Absolutely not. Do not let sadness prevent new starts because you're afraid of a pissy ending. Five of Cups, Ace of Swords, Ten of Cups reversed. Don't lay in the sadness because you're going to miss the cup. Four of Cups reversed. Help should grow. I'm going to leave it at that. First card, last card. All right, Virgo, I love you. Thanks for coming down and hanging out. I hope it helps somebody. Okay. I'll catch you in a couple of weeks. A couple of days. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm uploading a lot more content. I'm learning to manage my time now that my son's back in school. So, um, got a lot going on, but I'm going to do right by you guys and Keep the messages flowing. All right. So know that you loved. Be blessed. And I will catch you next time.